Leslie here, your Fred's editor at Guitar Player Magazine, with this beautiful Martin CS Custom Shop SC Limited Edition 2022. Only 300 of them made. One of them right here. Feeling very blessed to have this in my hands and to share the look and the feel and the sound with all y'all. This is a very special um, version of the SC and what makes it very different from all the others is that, I mean, not only is it made in the custom shop, it's the only one made in Nazareth, in America. The, the rest of them are in the Road Series. They're, they're made in Mexico out of veneered woods. This is made out of solid Sitka for the top and solid East Indian Rosewood for the beautiful back and sides. And it's got many, it's kind of a cross between the S and the Modern Deluxe. You series, you see the liquid metal bridge pins, it's got a torified top, it's got the gold um, frets there, and the golden tuners. Uh huh. And like all of the S guitars, though, it has the Sure Align linear dovetail connection, the dovetail joint, right? So it's going like this inside there instead of like this. That means this whole apparatus is not there. It allows you to get way up into the upper register and the upper register of the lower strings. I'm in an open D uh, tuning here, but you can really hear, listen to it ringing out. The intonation up there is fantastic. See, it's kind of like having a Martin Stratocaster in a way. It's got the playability of practically of an electric guitar, but it sure has the real feel of a Martin acoustic guitar. And the uh, it's based on the Grand Performer body. The S is so it's but it's kind of shifted forward, so you get that S shape there. Huh? And then the uh, the depth is kind of is exactly of a triple O or an O M, and it's. Sound and, and playability is kind of a cross between those two because you have the scale length, the full 24, uh, 25.4 scale length, like an OM, so you get that percussive stuff. Um, but it's joined at the 13th fret, not the 14th. And according to Tim Teal, the lead designer there, that allows it to have sort of the playability of a shorter scale and the bendability you can feel in the. And so the neck itself is helical, it's voluptuous in the open position with maybe a little bit of the bass shaved away so that you can get a good thumb wrap down here for your cowboy chords and everything. As you cruise up, it balances out and the bar chords are nice and easy to make. And then as you cruise up the neck and you naturally want to get further up in here, it accommodates for that and sort of shaves away a little more there and then you can get all the way from look at that you know you can really get all the way up into it so that playability is just man it's it's uh unbelievable for an acoustic instrument and for this acoustic instrument you're really getting the full body sound of the martin that i mean guys like me have been you know clamoring for this since they came out with the first one could they potentially make one out of solid woods and kind of cross it with the modern deluxe features. It, and we were thinking more about that price point, but this one is eight grand because it's a custom shop instrument with all these fancy seashells and they only made 300 of them. And um, they explained to me that the idea here is that if we could get people interested in these and the collectors could pick them up and some of the hardcore enthusiasts like myself, then hopefully we'll see some uh, American-made production models if they can get the tool and die necessary from Mexico up to Nazareth and you know fingers crossed we'll see that in the future. Um, check out the full review in Guitar Player Magazine's June issue with Mr. Edge on the front. Here it is. I'll play you out. Thanks for watching. Thanks for listening. Here we go.